parliament, I want to start by saying this. A lie is a lie even if it's sugar-coated. Yes. yes. You are a lie is a lie even if majority are following the lie. So when somebody is foolishly lying to these honorable members and is genuinely lying, at least you should be a rightful liar. But this one, you are a wrongful liar. The issue of bipartisan talk, you mentioning only one member who pocketed some good amount of money. What about the colleagues from your camp? Yes, you are very wise. <laughs> that was just by the way, to hit on the point. By the way. Mr. Speaker, the state of our nation being ruled by a serial liar, followed by liars, Talking of all ill lies, we won't allow that. The big psychophants of this nation. It's the right time we've woken up. If you think you'll come again and fool us, we can't accept you addressing world, telling us that Mkuru Kwajenga is UK. Yet even Soweto is much better than Mkuru Kwajenga. What a lie is that? Big and you stand boldly saying that. Can you say something you can defend? Mr. Speaker, as I conclude, I want to be brief as a goat's tail. Number four, get ready. As I conclude, this honorable member who are not making noise to disrupt a colleague because he was talking on his time, he was lying. And we won't entertain liars. Number four, come forward. So now on the bipartisan, as my walking dictionary is going to take these microphones, <laughs> bipartisan talk never touched on common one inch's life. And we will touch it our own way. Walking dictionary. Thank you. Thank you. Punge viva. Viva.